There is a possibility some towns here in western Massachusetts could see less of those destructive gypsy moth caterpillars. 22 News Storm Team Meteorologist Jennifer Paye is working for you to find out why. Is what western Massachusetts needed but finally got this spring, and that's rain. Gypsy moth caterpillars were a major issue in many western Massachusetts towns in 2015 and last year, going after oak, maple, birch, and poplar trees and eating their leaves. 2015 and 2016 were the same years western Massachusetts was in a long, ongoing drought. But thanks to all the rain so far this spring, western Massachusetts could possibly be seeing fewer of these caterpillars. Damper conditions bring out an insect killing fungus. This fungus since roughly um, 1989 or so has been largely responsible for keeping the gypsy moth population reduced and it's thought that the drought conditions in 2015 and 2016 are responsible for the increased population that that we've been seeing. The caterpillar eggs have hatched and will soon be looking for leaves to eat. If you see them on your property, they are not harmful to humans. Gypsy moth caterpillars are more of a problem for trees, not people. So if you see them in your yard, they're not going to bring a major health risk to people. Depending on how much rain we get this spring, we could see fewer caterpillars come late summer. Right now, it's too soon to tell. This type of insect killing fungus will not grow in dry conditions. And for more information on gypsy moths, you can head to our website at WWLP.com. Live in Holyoke, meteorologist Jennifer Paye, 22 News.